take five. Deet, 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 deet. Where's my money? We're going to snell up again because of this, bro. <laughs> this is take five, guys. Take five for our Sorry, first bro, video. Your neck is like a credit card holder. Yeah, no. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. So, guys, to make a YouTube video, it's really hard. So don't judge us, please. <laughs> like, we've been busy for an hour. So we're gonna start this vlog off like this. This is our first YouTube video. And this is Snail Army. I'm still waiting for my money. You're not getting any money. Why not? Because you're a credit card holder. I, we're not famous yet. You're ATM or, now. I don't even think we're ever gonna get famous, but you know. It's like an ATM. This is Snail Army. And don't judge us. No, totally. Please don't. Please don't. And please leave something down in the comments, something nice, you know, to give us some motivation. Like a boost That would be or really something. nice. Yeah. So, I'm Alex. I'm Dylan. And we are Snail Army. So I hope you enjoy our video, because we're going to jump right into it. And this could really make you dizzy. So for people that are, like, car sick, fast and all that, just like, you know what, just like, skip a little bit. It's going to make you dizzy. I'm sorry, okay? Could you help me? Yeah. Okay, come on. Oh, hey guys. Welcome back. Hopefully that didn't make you too dizzy. But we're back. Yeah. And we time traveled a little bit together with you guys. And our setup is right there. Sorry about that. I, I still have to get used to this. I'm sorry. But we got our setup ready. Let's see it. Okay, I'm going to help you out. Sure. Help me out? Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright, so. so we have here the first box of our uh, first unveiling. So I'm gonna wrap this up. Wait, is that gold? That's exactly gold. Yeah, I know, it's mine. That's why. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm fancy, totally. you know. That's just who I am, bro. Gold. You know, gold. So, yeah, as you can see, we didn't load them up or anything, but this is a feature I really like about this. It's awesome. And it sounds like a real gun. It's out of gas right now, but, you know. We're gonna fill them up in a bit, but first, we're gonna give kind of a review. These are really easy to clean out and all that. So yeah, I have like pens on the side here, right here and there. Just, you have to pull them down. Do this, do that, and it's off. That's it, right there. So you have your hopper right here, spring, all that, to get all this out of here. It's an easy clean gun. <laughs> yep. They're really easy to clean out and all that. So if you can see, you can just like remove every part on this B gun. See, you can just detach it. This one just comes out. And that's it. Like you can clean everything like this. Really nice, really nice model. Just put it back together, just like that. Put your spring back in. Come on. Yeah, there we go. And yes, this is a lot easier than a real gun. Believe me. You just have to line this like that. Just have to line it. Right. Just like no, just like this. Yes. We got it. And then just that's it. It's a really easy gun. It's really light. Even when the mag is in there, it's really light. It's a good one. It's compact. Good for competition. It's perfect. I like it. So now, we're actually going to show Dylan's gun. Let's see what that is. Something special too. Really nice. So, how am I going to unbox this? The same case. that we use. It's actually a base of a so it's environment friendly. So 
those are the babies. It's based of corn. It's environment friendly. It's compressor. Okay. So the only difference is it's a black one. It's a fully black Glock 17. Like he said before, it's very reliable, very easy to use, like corners and all that kind of stuff. We have the same mags, we use the same gas as well. It's uh yeah, oh. he can't do a little bit, but now he is fixed. Yes. It's very easy, especially with, if you're wearing this. This is actually a leg holster. Do this. Strap it up at your leg. Oh, bro, I think we're gonna get demonetized because of your swim shorts. Yeah. <laughs> okay, but it's nice, you know. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Real nice. So you put up a, in your magazine, load them up. Get it right here. Then I have another place for my second Mac. Put it here. Yeah. It's a little bit hard, but eventually it will get there on this place. Yeah, it's not in all right. Okay, there you go. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Better. See, it's compact. It's tight. It's good. Like it's it's not gonna fall off or anything. And, and normally there is like okay, there's this like little thing you can hook onto it. And this can hook on to your belt. So it's good. It's it's really compact. And to get it out, it's just you have to press this button. Let's demonstrate. Yeah, see? And that's, then it comes out. Without pressing that button, nothing happens. It's, so it's really good. Like when you're running safe. or anything, it won't fall out at all. It's actually safe to wear. It's very light, compact. And you can then switch up your Mac. Push it back, and the mag in the pocket, and you're back to home. So, okay, the gas that we used, it's... Oh, good? Okay. Yeah. Cool. So, I'm going to show you my beautiful, most beautiful bottle I have. This is the gas we use. Why we use this gas is because it gives your gun, like, oil. Like, you know, you have to lubricate your gun once in a while. But with this oil and gas combined, you don't have to lubricate your gun because it does it automatically. The only thing you have to do is just wrap some oil off sometimes. And that's it. It's the only thing you have to do. You don't have to, like, check up and, like, get, like, oil everywhere and all that. It's very simple. So, actually, we're going to load up one and show it to you guys. It's really easy. These are, like... They really look real. The only thing that's different is this little thing, but other than that, they really look like the real thing. So, <clears throat> what you have to do, well, I do it like this. don't have to, but I do it like that. See this? They call this a uh, speed loader. And so you fill it up with old balls and all that, and then you can just like, you know, go like this. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to show it. You know what? I'm just going to show it. So these are our babies, and they're the same ones that I use. Clamps, yeah. So I put them in this bottle because it's easier to pour in this. That's easy. Well, I thought it was easy. That's it. Don't ever fill them up too high because then it's just gonna block and not work at all. So, then you have your mag. Just pull down this thing all the way. So you have like a wider gap in here. And you just put this one over here. Just like, you know, in this little area. Just put it in there. And just start pulling it up. And then just give it a little shaky. No. So they'll line up great and perfect. See, you have like a little gap right here, right? 
That's why I do this. I shake it up, and now it's gone. Perfect. So then, you have a full mag. And... Okay. So, another thing actually, I forgot to say something. The max of BBs you can put in here are 17. If you fill them up too much, you're just gonna destroy this Mac. And they're not that, they're not cheap. <laughs> Never do that. Yo, bro, bro, hello, mm -hmm. yeah, we back alive. Uh, okay? Oh, snail, okay. Sorry. Nah, no problem, no problem. Okay. We are back. Coming close. I yeah. have to show them something. Yeah, okay. I forgot to show yeah. them. Okay. Yeah, okay, I'm coming okay. close, yeah, okay. So you can only put like 17 BBs in these mags because, you know, they're. If you fill them up too much, they're gonna break. Well, you can fill them up a little bit more, but it's not. But you shouldn't. Yeah. Okay. So this is our gas. We already talked about this. Okay. So to fill up this mag, you have to. There's like a little hole in the bottom here. Can you see this? The focusing. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So there's a little hole right here. And here you have this pen, so I have to put it right in there. Like this, right? Four times three, three exactly. Seconds. Three sec, three times three, three seconds. Three times, yeah. Three seconds, yeah, is probably best. Better. So one, two, three. One, two, three. That's about it, right? Yep. Okay, that's it. No, I'm just gonna. The first time, I wasn't three seconds. No, right. You can oh. never actually overfill them, but. Just counting. Just count. So, this is a full mag. The gas gives it the power to shoot out the gun. So, now I can shoot all I want. Doesn't work. Just like a weird gun. Just because the mag is in there doesn't mean you have your first BB in there. So, what you have to do is just, you have to pull it, and then you just, you know, make it safe. You have to do this. Full mag, perfect. So when your mag is empty, and you gotta put it away, there's a little release button on the back. You have to push it, and then it releases the gas that's still inside of your mag. You always have to do that before you put it back in your like coffin or whatever you make, your chest or like a little thing like this, like ours. It's, it's good. Why I'm saying that, because if it's a hot day and it's in like your car or somewhere like inside your house and it, the sun is constantly in the box, this will heat up and explode. So that's why you always have to release the pressure out of these, because your valve down there can be like, it can mess up a lot. So you just have to press a little button on the back here to empty the pressure. And it just goes like this. Oh, and be sure to not point it at somebody. Because we're gonna show you. I think the wall is better. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that. show it to the wall. Okay. Okay, you can see it, right? Yeah. I'm just gonna point it to the wall. All right. Because it's gonna, you're gonna see it. You're gonna see it flash. Look at this. You see that? Did I caught it on camera? Yeah. yeah. Hopefully, you guys could see it. But <clears throat> it's dangerous if you get it in the eyes and your eyes because it's grease. It's not only air. It has, you know. Greasy stuff that's in it, oil based stuff to, you know, for gun. So you don't have to do that ever. Because that's the only thing you have to do is wipe it off. I guess after like four to five mags, you have to clean it out. Just like rub off the oil because it will just like fill up in your gun and that's it's not a good thing. It, it would jam, right? It would jam, yeah. Okay. So, yeah, that's about it. And they really shoot straight. They're really good. And, yeah, it's, it's actually perfect. Well, I actually have... Um, I'm going to do something. What are you doing, bro? Okay. 
Okay. Yo, bro. Oh, oh, oh shit, bro! Stop, 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 what? stop. Okay, stop, stop. Nah, nah. Is that too close? Yeah, and it hurts. Okay. Sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Bro, just, just put it away. Okay. What? No. Ah, fuck. Bro, 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 whoa, whoa. Stop, okay? Stop. Just put it away. Just put it away. Damn, that hurts, bro. Why? Well, I wanna give him a review. Yeah, bro. Oh my god. You okay? Not really, bro. Are you good? Not really, no. It hurts a lot. Okay. That really hurt that, bro? Yeah, yeah, bro, it hurts, yeah. How much FPS is this? Like, I don't know. I don't know, bro. But it's hard. Oh my god. Yeah. Bro. Yeah, well. Okay, let, just, just give us a minute, guys. I think I kind of messed up. Because you guys kind of... I think you want to see this. Like... Oh. Look at his arm. This is after like 10 minutes. Yo, I got you at your side too, right? Yeah, you said I exactly. Your side? Yeah. Look, look at this. Look at that. Look, look at all that. Does it hurt? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> so why I actually did that to him is because he bought his yesterday and he shot me. That was not on purpose, bro. Yeah, but it's payback. Yeah, but he paid me back really good, more than one time. Okay, let's like, stop. Okay, we're just gonna tell you guys like. We just put a marker and that was an empty gap. Yeah. So, actually be very careful what you're doing with that gun. That gun can really leave marks like this. And I'm just gonna tell you this, we are bringing up a video where we're gonna shoot each other. Yeah. But from a far di distance. Not that close. <laughs> Never shoot somebody that from this close. Yeah. Ever. Always. Well, if it's an accident, you can't do anything about it, but if yeah. it's real... Like you're really just like, oh, you doing it on purpose? No, like, no, don't do that. No, no. That's dangerous. And always, if you are airsofting in an area like a forest or something else, don't aim at the head of the person. Never. You're always wearing protective Wear protection. Glasses, mask, helmet, and aim at the body, not at the head. Because if Another one thing. BB goes straight into your eye, you can lose your eye as well. What I want to say is, whenever you go airsofting, wear gloves, like tactical gloves. Yeah. Because I had issues before. I've been airsofting a lot of times. He also. And we both got shot at the hands and all that. Yeah. And after that, we're always wearing gloves because it really hurts. And we get to give you some advice on that. Wear gloves. Even from a distance, like 10, 15 meters away from each other, it hurts. Yeah, also. you have to know just like... Some guys shoot with guns that are like really powerful. Like sniping rifles? Yes, okay. They're plastic, kind of. They're not plastic, they're... Ours are not plastic. They're like Based nature, the so... Form, yeah, but but still it some of them are plastic in that. Like it's... That's hard. But... Okay. They look like they're nothing, but... They can get stuck inside of your like... You know, your arm or anything, or like in your back or... Your fingers can turn out like black on the tip of your fingers if you get shot at them, and it hurts. Yep. It really does. So, be safe. Be safe. And I think this will be kind of the end for today. Yeah. Because, you know, hopefully you liked our videos. Our video. And... Yeah, this was our review from the Glock Airsoft edition. <laughs> yeah. Um, but actually, we have a surprise for you guys in our next video. And it's, it's, and there is actually an Easter egg in this video to yeah. know about it. So if you watch this video again, just rewatch some like in the beginning of the video, yeah. and you will see something. It's a brand. That's the only thing we're gonna say, like, and you'll see, yep. you'll see. So I guess so, we're gonna sign off right now, and hopefully, we'll see you, we'll see you back next time.
now we're following out video of this and just remember just really remember really good keep on snailing that's so it that's it guys keep on snailing and so, support our channel exactly. like subscribe and please press on the notification bell because else you will not know where we're talking about just now so so you later, guys. I'm Dylan. This is Alex. See you next time. See you next time, guys. Keep on snailing. Keep guys. on snailing. Bye. So hey, today, guys, we're back with Dylan. Yeah, and he's gonna give you a review of his gun. Where is it? Oh, right here. Okay. Here's his gun. Here's my gun. This is. Yeah, actually, I was gonna show you how to refill this, but then my girlfriend called. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. You know what? I'm just gonna delete this video anyway. It's just for fun because I wanna fuck with this dude. <laughs> <laughs>